So what I'm going to be sharing with you today are the shampoo, conditioner, the purple shampoo, the hairspray, the brush, everything that I use to get to this hair. So first off, what I would like to share with you is my shampoo and conditioner. So these are the Redken All Soft Shampoo and Conditioner. And this product is meant for softness and dry brittle hair. So this is amazing for my hair because I used to have really dry hair before using this. And since my hair is dyed blonde, I do have a lot of breakage at the ends of my hair. So that really helps reduce the breakage and makes my hair very, very soft. So the other shampoo that I use, and this is every other day, every other time that I wash my hair, is the Joico Color Balance Shampoo. And this is a purple shampoo. Purple shampoo is essential for blonde hair because it will cancel all of the brass tones and it will cancel everything that you don't want in your hair just to keep the color vibrant and to, for it to look healthy all day. It's very, very essential in my hair care routine. So another thing is the wet brush. So this is a brush that you can find in Target and Ulta, pretty much anywhere now. This brush is amazing for if you get a lot of tangles like I do. I literally get so many tangles all the time. It's super annoying. But this brush has saved my hair because literally every time that I would brush my hair with a different brush, it would get caught right here and I would be stuck and it hurts so bad. And you do not want to rip your hair out because you want every little piece to stay on your head. So I absolutely love this brush. I use it when I get out of the shower and it just dry, ugh. and it just brushes your hair and your tangles out like a dream. It's so good. Another thing that I use very frequently is going to be the Beach Club Texture Spray by IGK. This is one of my newer additions to my hair care routine and it's amazing. It keeps my hair in the beach waves all day without it being crunchy or without it like being disgusting basically because I know that there's so many hairsprays out there that make your hair feel gross and it's just not okay. So that one is very, very good. It is a little more on the expensive side, but I swear when you invest in your hair, it is very, very essential because it's healthy, it's beautiful, it shines and everything that you want it to do. And the curling iron that I will be using in this video is the one that I used in my previous video. So this is going to be the Beach Waver. It is a one and one and a half inch. And in this video, you will see that I do not use it in the traditional sense of that clamp that's on there because I figured if I used it in a different way that I wouldn't get such of the bouncy curls that I didn't want. I wanted more of the loose curls. I wanted to be able to brush it out and that the curl would still be there, but it wouldn't be so like in my face. So if you would like to see the finished product and how I curl my hair, then please keep on watching. So first I'm gonna use the wet brush and I just have the black one I got at Target and I'm just gonna use that to brush all of my hair out just to make sure I don't have any tangles before I start curling my hair. And then I will just take any like rubber band or clip or anything and I'll just section off a piece of my hair. Okay. So I'm going to use the Beach Waver curling iron that I had in my last video, but I've been using it just kind of manually, not with the clip. First, I'm just gonna take a little section of hair and then I'm just gonna curl it inwards and then I'm gonna do it outwards and I'm gonna alternate that all through my hair. And I won't leave it for very long because I want that beachy, like salty wave because with this beach waver, when I put my hair in the clamp, it gave me more of a, like more of a spirally wave more than the beachy wave and maybe I was using it wrong, but I figured if I used it like this, that I would get the perfect curl. So I'm just gonna repeat this all the way throughout my hair. I do have a lot of hair, so this does take about 20 minutes. So I'll probably fast forward through all of this and then I will see you here when I am all finished. So that's 
going to be it for this video. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, then subscribe to my channel, please. Hit that button. And I hope that you have a great rest of your day. Bye.